Morning Hollins crew, this is WHIA TV bringing you the morning announcements. Will you please stand and say the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing to recite our school creed. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. As I pass through the doors of Hollis each day, I will strive to do my best in every way. I am committed to excellence and nothing less because my education is the key to my success. I will respect my school and those who teach and guide me. I will respect myself and those who sit beside me. I will always do my share to show that I care. I am proud to be a Hollis student. Great morning, Hollis Academy. Next week is Random Acts of Kindness Week, and I, Mr. Tolliver, your SEO coach, wants to tell you of some things we have going on here at Hollis. So during Random Acts of Kindness Week, here is one initiative that we have going on here at Hollis. You are to come to the main office and choose one of the Random Acts of Kindness that you would like to display. This is one I really like. It says, say thank you whenever you are handed something. So I'm going to take the kindness card as well as the certificate off of the line. Thank you, Ms. Curry. You're welcome. Ms. Curry, I just performed a kindness act during Random Acts of Kindness Week, and I'm going to give you this card because I said thank you whenever you handed me something. Okay. If you don't mind, could you fit complete this being kind card? Yes, I will. Step number three would be to then turn in your caught being kind card to Mr. Tolliver. Mr. Tolliver will then put your caught being kind card on the line. Our goal here at Hollis is to have 100 Call Being Kind cards on the line by February the 16th, 2018. I believe in you. You can do it. Let's get it done. Be kind. The word of the week is determined. We've pronounced it. We've spelled it. We used it in a sentence. And showed you an example of how to determine or how to make the best decision. Now it's your turn to participate. Let's see how much you learned about the word determine. Now we're going to evaluate and test you. So take out a sheet of paper and a pencil and write down the answers to these two questions. Question number one, what is the best meaning of determine? A, to read a book. B, to decide on something or to choose something. C, to walk to the store. Or D, to write a poem. Now, question number two. Which is the correct spelling of our word of the week? Is it A, D, E, T, U, M, E, N, E? B, D, E, T, E, R, M-I-N-E, is it C-D-I-T-E-M-I-N-E, -E, or D, D-E-T-T-E-R-M-I-N-E. -E. Now, here are the answers. Question one, the answer is B, to decide on something or to choose something. Question two, the correct answer is B, D-E-T-E-R-M-I-N-E. -E. Congratulations if you got them both correct. See you next week.